for checking out this video uh, I realized that I've not been posting any videos for a while right now and yeah this for the past few weeks I've nothing interesting to talk about so I'm just <laughs> it was uh, exam period so I just you know revise and take exams and sitting in my bedroom all day I have not been away from my dormitory behind me here you have all seen for like a month already and the spring has gone now it's oh yeah it's, yeah look at this uh, flowers some auntie doing something it's about this is now spring yeah in the middle of the spring i finished all my midterm exams i'm just walking to get some fruit which i rarely rarely do actually i do a lot of online shopping but i think the store that I usually go, the Lotte Market, a small convenience store. It is like a 20, 21st anniversary or something, so they do a lot of discount. I think that might be cheaper that way. I usually bought online via Kupang, if you know what Kupang is. It's like the leading online shopping, like the Amazon of Korea. So everything turned green. Looks really nice, and the flowers are uh, blooming. The cherry blossoms ended like a month ago. If you missed that video, I have I have a video on that too, where I go to a park, and there is like rows and rows of cherry blossoms here in Incheon. It's really beautiful. Now everything is just green. I love that too. Temperature now is changing. I've been a little sick. And later this week, I'm going to get another COVID test, which I'm not sure. I've been avoiding vlogging when I get the test because, you know, I respect other uh, people's privacy. But maybe I do a little photo when I get the test. It's for the dormitory again. and. I've been getting some cold and sneezing, so I might want to get tested again to make sure, but I don't have any other symptoms, so maybe a simple flu. I'm not sure. Let's, let's see. If it turned out positive, I, I might not release this video. <laughs> if it is, then I'll put it in all the wind uh, video. The bike almost hit me. And that is the store. I am walking to oh, greenhouse. Vlogging with these small cameras, I don't feel weird. I have a Canon M50, which is big, and I am afraid that people would, you know, think I'm crazy. But this one, no one gives an eye on me. That's good. My plan is to buy some lemon and orange. Where is the orange? What is the orange? Ten, ten thousand. How many kilos? Hmm? Oh, that's a lot. Sixteen to eighteen. Oranges. Yeah, I think that's all I'm gonna get. Here's the store. Give you an idea. And yeah, it's kind of big, big store. Okay, let's go. Let's get out of here. All this is obsessed. Yes. What I'm gonna get only. Oh, check out the ice cream store. Been here many times with Linden, our special guest, but have not shown you where the ice creams. So.
this is the like a wholesale ice cream. It's really cheap. Let me show you. So it's self service. So you take whatever you want here, ice cream. Anything. And it's like 30% the price of a regular uh, convenience store. And you pay up front like that. I'm not gonna buy, I'm sick. I, I, I'm, I'm not gonna buy anything, but I just wanna show you. So you can then pay here. Yep. Just quickly, uh, someday I'll come here and show you. With Linin, he loves ice cream. I do too, but I can. I'm sensitive to all the cold things. So I can't eat any ice anymore. Go back to my normal routine with a lot of hot water. So yeah, if you're coming to Korea, then find out this sale ice cream shop. Chip, but like a stick of an ice cream in a regular store, they would be like a thousand, one thousand five hundred won. And here, it's only four hundred won, so it's like thirty percent price. And a lot of people just grab like you know twenty, thirty ice creams and pay and just keep them and eat. I guess some people just only buy them and then you know resale also. That's crazy, chip. The same brand, I mean, the same brand of ice cream. How could they sell so differently in the regular, like GS25 or 7 Eleven or CU? And then here is like 30% price. That is crazy. If you like this kind of a lot, I might not do it more frequently because well I don't go out a lot COVID situation and my day is boring get up shower and stay in the room and take online classes nothing interesting just, just to show you but maybe if you like this kind of vlogs I try to come out more and show you my kind of Daily life, oh my god. I just climb up the hill and out of breath. Wow, I think it's brighter. So, I'm trying to speak English in this vlog again because I'm trying to practice my English as well for my upcoming. I might do a, I might take a TOEFL, a TOEFL an IELTS test in a few months for my graduations because they required an English certificate, English score and for those of you who are native speaker and you know if you happen to wander around and you know just accidentally click on one of these videos please excuse my English it's not that good but I'm trying my best this is my best Oh my god, it's heavy. It's like five kilos on my right arm right now. Good evening. Today it's Tuesday and I've just come out of my room. Today for dinner we were trying to find cheese ball. Uh, you know, but Originally there was a cheese ball at KFC, but they changed the menu to mac and cheese ball. And then we went out from KFC to get to another chicken place, which was supposed to have cheese ball also. We bought pasta every time, but we never bought the cheese ball there. We bought the chicken there every time though. And then the store was closed. <laughs> today and very unfortunate and then we were just like 
uh, we would eat anything. And then we come here to the No Brand Burger. This is a new store, open for about a month. I came here during the first day of opening. There was a lot of people. And luckily there were cheese ball and there was what? Plant, plant based chicken nugget. Yeah. So let's try that plant based chicken nugget. Is it gonna taste like chicken or not? I don't know. And we got two other burgers. And the burger here is insane. Look at the price here. That one's regular burger, bukuki, only 1,900 won. So it's like one dollar and fifty. While at regular burger store, that would be three dollars. This is so cheap. That's why it's named No Brand Burger. The weather today is so awful, everyone. It was sunny a few days ago, and now it's cold again. It's been like this, like every week. Sunny, cold, sunny, cold, and raining. There were too many people at the store, so we have our food taken out. So we found this spot to eat our food. And we really want to try the plant-based chicken nugget. So let's try one right here. Wow. Oops. The taste is pretty pretty similar, but the texture is a little softer, a little like broken down. And the real like chicken nugget is quite chewy and like uh, bouncy, but quite good. Mm -hmm.